Capricorn. This is going to be for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. What is, what is the overall message for Capricorn? What is the overall message for Capricorn? Choices. I feel like you guys need to be careful with the choices that you're faced with. You could be trying to figure out who like to have some fun with too right now. Somebody could be very attracted to you or vice versa. Yeah, I'm saying that the ace of wands coming out. Yeah, I feel like somebody's trying to ma manifest a new beginning with you. Maybe they're looking in for another go around, like to spin the block again with you at Capricorn. You might have left this person out in the cold or they left you out in the cold. Like somebody got rejected. I feel like the reason being was because they were trying to end a certain type of cycle and be smart about the decisions. Like I said before, being careful with making cho choices. Seeing something very clear and honest. Somebody definitely rejected a lover. And that lover is thinking about coming back in. But someone here just doesn't want to get stuck in the same cycle. So that's where some hesitancy could be coming from. Maybe somebody got a new home. Someone here could be in prison in some form or fashion. There could also be somebody that needs a place to stay. Um, someone could be dealing with a person born in February. There could be someone dealing with a dark skinned home man, or you could be dark. A darker skin tone man with darker features. There's a two-faced friend here as well. Um, maybe there was some uh, bad health back in February, which is why a person was rejected. Okay, this could do. This could be dealing with sexual health or. Um, emotional health okay it could have been something physical or, or emotional more than likely um this caused someone to reject an individual and another person just moved on like and had fun with another situation <sighs> Or someone unknown, unknown to you, Capricorn. Okay. Sorry about the light. Yeah. Somebody could have been having fun and ended up dealing with some, getting involved with somebody that was dealing with other people. They changed lovers a lot. Okay. But it looks like this person... It looks like since this situation has happened, this person wants to put an end to like third parties. They only want to be with one person now. But they want to have a second chance with you, Capricorn. They're watching 
or they're figuring out that you were like telling the truth or they're they're thinking that you are like the one for them maybe you took care of them well or nurtured them back to good health for some of you and like I said they want to turn it around this could be a message of concern for you what's the outcome for Capricorn somebody could be apologizing what is the outcome for Capricorn please Yeah, I feel like somebody is coming in on a positive note, trying to successfully recover a situation. They want to they want to start off slow and steady and build back up. But they definitely want to take action towards you in love. I feel like they have like major feelings for you, Capricorn. Somebody here could be at a distance. Yeah, somebody they, they definitely received karma. It could be a baby daddy, baby mama situation going on. Ooh, toxic, toxic love. It's like you know they coming in, Capricorn. And you could be holding back because this gets on your nerves. They can make good money. But that bad health was some karma for them. Somebody definitely wants to get married and settle down. Because I feel like they were betrayed by somebody that was already involved. Now they're now they're concerned if you're gonna like be willing to deal with them. Looks like they were dealing with somebody at a distance. So they overcame whatever bad health they had, whatever health issue they had. They overcame it where they are now. And they cut, they cut the person off or they cut the situation off. And the parting of the ways came out. Someone gossiping about your secrets. Wow. Looks like they're stressed, okay? They're trying to save money. They're concerned about you guys being together. You could be dealing with somebody born in December or you, your anniversary or something is in December for some of you. Or maybe this is when they want to come back or when they are going to come back. Because I didn't put a time on this reading. Okay. You could have, you could be traveling like for money or something like that could be going on with you, Capricorn. Yeah, I feel like somebody is just trying to figure out what actions to take to make something right because it looked like you just dropped it. You just dropped it and, and closed the door on it and just accepted the fact that this person is uh, mentally unstable for some of you. And for others of you, they're just toxic. Yeah, you were like, this is it. They're just too toxic. I'm going to cut them off and move on. And do what's best for me. And work on achieving success for myself. Yeah, you're moving on from the situation. What is the advice for Capricorn? What is the advice for Capricorn? Advice 
advice for Capricorn. I feel like you're developing more awareness. Yeah, it's to end it. End the commitment. End it because this person is all over the place. You need more stability. This person is full of their ego and they don't like give in or give room um, to you. So yeah, it's best for you to just swap away and end it. Take a leap of faith. The lies are getting louder. The deception is here. Like, the more you commit yourself, the more deceptive this person becomes. Just stay confident in your decision, even though you might be feeling like you're lacking them in some way. The relationship just stresses you out too much, okay? You had more confidence in a situation with a person that was uh, more family-oriented. Like where there was a stronger foundation. Or this is going to be what you're going to go towards. For some of you, you haven't encountered this yet. That's why it's going to be in the future for you. But some, some of you guys have already met this individual. Could be a Leo with the strength here. Or they could just be very confident, okay, in wanting a family unit. You end it with this fool. That's clearly what's coming out. You're going to keep finding out that they're, if you were to commit to this person, if they committed to them, you're going to have instances where you're finding out that they're cheating or like they're just not honest, okay? They're going to be triggering your um wounds your childhood wounds yeah it just needs to be over the coffin coming out as well the death the eight of cups in the coffin the world is here as well these are all ending cards you need to start new some of y'all may need to like if you've been separated from this person for a while, you could be dating other people. Mm -hmm. They think highly of you, the person that you're supposed to be leaving, but they're just too prideful. They just have a big ego. You need somebody that's going to take care of you regardless in all areas. Mm-hmm. You're going to regret your decision if you go forward with this person. Some of y'all born in January. And you're going to be very glad once you um link up with whoever this person is that wants the Ten of Pentacles with you. You're going to be very glad once you go towards that. The most difficult part of the situation is going to be over. <laughs> I see some of y'all rejecting people. That are wishy-washy. That are like fast. Okay, that don't want commitment. You're, you're getting away from those people. You're turning those people down. Because you want to change for better. Walking away from lack and disappointment. Some of y'all could be moving from the community that you're in or getting away from the community or environment that you're in that brought nothing but lack. Okay. And then that's when you're going to see successful outcomes to your problems. All right, Capricorn, so these were your messages. If this video resonated, please like, share, subscribe. Thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you next time.